Welcome to video five of the ZLC Fast Start program. And remember, this is a combination. This is a 30 day fast start and a 120 day fast start because we have two goals. We got three things to get done in the first 30 days. And then we've got that event, that paid event that you're gonna do about 120 days on average after you graduate from ZLC, your certification course right here in Plano, Texas. So this section is about near marketing. And I wanna explain what near marketing is. NEAR marketing stands for Naturally Existing Economic Relationships. And that, ter that term, that phrase, that concept was developed by a gentleman named Walter Haley. So if you've read the book, See at the Top, and I hope you have, you will see in there the Walter Haley story. It talks about how he built this incredible insurance agency through NEAR marketing and more importantly through the foundational principles that we teach at ZLC. So what is NEAR marketing? Well, naturally existing economic relationships. If you want to get more detail on that, Walter Haley wrote a book, and I know you can get it on Amazon. It's called Breaking the No Barrier, and he's going to go in there and, and talk about the system itself. But basically, it's this idea. It's finding businesses that we can align with that if we help them grow, they grow. Or even better for this specific scenario is we find a business who has customers and as a ZLC trainer, what we do is he, we help performance go up. So imagine this, imagine if we help the customers of that business, if we help them grow, then wouldn't it make sense that they would do more business with that business? I'm gonna give you some perfect examples here as we go through this. The first one is what I call the customer appreciation approach. So let's just suppose you go to a hotel, a hotel in your area, and they have, they have guests coming in all the time, the chances are pretty good, and I'm talking about a business hotel. Uh, you know, this could be a nice one like a Hilton or a, or a Weston or something like that, or it could be a Holiday Inn Express or, or whatever hotel in your area that kind of supports the local business community. That hotel likely has anywhere from 10 to 20 customers in their area whose vendors and salespeople and people associated with that business where they stay in when they come to town. And these top 20 or 10 of these customers of the hotel, they might have 50 to 100 room nights a year. So here's the idea. You come to the hotel manager and you say something like this. Hi, I'm Tom Ziegler. I'm, you know, I'm a Ziegler certified trainer. And one of the things that I'm focused on my personal business is to help improve the performance of people personally and professionally. And I was just curious if, you know, you seem like a good hotel, or you've got a good reputation in the, in the area, and it seems like there might be some key accounts here that you service who regularly send you a lot of customers. Maybe it's their salespeople, their vendors, people who travel in to visit the company. And I'm wondering, have you ever thought about doing a customer appreciation event for them? And of course, the manager is going to go, well, what do you mean? You know, and you, this is where you get to explain who Ziegler is if they don't know. And you say, you know, have you ever put your arms around and hugged and loved on your top 20 customers? Well, what do you have in mind? Well, what if you did this for your customers? What if you hosted a thank you breakfast or lunch where you just brought in these top 25 customers in your local area, people who were booking a lot of rooms with you, and you fed them nice and you gave them a gift and I came and I presented the Ziegler Performance Formula to your customers. You could announce and you know you could you could market to them that you're bringing in a Ziegler uh, speaker or trainer, and that you're going to talk about performance. And here's the best part: is the talk is only about 25 minutes long total. And then the manager's going to say, "Well, what is this performance formula thing you're talking about?" And this is where you get to outline the performance formula about how it's attitude and effort and skill, those multiplied together equal performance. So the manager's like, well, that sounds pretty good because you've been through that with them. You've showed them how that works. And then they're going to ask the next question. Well, how much are you going to charge to come in and speak for me? Now, this is, this is key. Now, this is cool and this is key. You see, now you get to establish value in the marketplace of what you're worth. And so you might say something like, well, normally for a full day of training, I charge $5,000, $7,500, $4,000. It's up to you what you do. But because I want to partner with you, I'm able to give you a better rate. Now, I wish I could do it for free, but the reality is 
It's all of your customers that we're working with. I want to help your customers grow because if your customers grow, then I know they're going to send more business to you because more salespeople, more vendors, more people coming in to see that business are going to stay in your hotel. So my job is to grow your customers and give them ideas that they can take back to their business to grow, yet I don't have any control over who comes. That's up to you. And so I do have to charge you a fee. So instead of my normal $5,000, I can do this for $2,000. Now, what the hotel manager is likely to say is, oh, I'm so sorry, we just, we just don't have any budget for something like that. And that's where we get creative, and that's where we say something like this. Well, Mr. Hotel Manager, <clears throat> since you see value in this, let me ask you a question. I regularly put on workshops in the area, and I notice that you have some beautiful rooms here that fit 30 to 60 people. What about if we did a trade? What if I did an event a quarter here, and in return, you gave that to me, and in return, I came in and did this customer appreciation workshop? For your, for your group when they're here. I'll do that 25 minute talk like we talked about. That way there's no cash change in hands, you're not paying up front. I'm gonna use one of these rooms once a quarter and I tell you what, I will work with you on dates to make sure that it's a good date for both of us. A date that works for me and a date that's not interfering with something that you already have planned on the books. Does that sound fair? So what's happened here? There's a naturally existing economic relationship. You see, you wanna do business with the hotel's customers. And the hotel wants those customers to grow in their business because if they do, they're gonna spend more money at the hotel. And so by introducing you through this format to the customers, you get to pour value into those customers, the performance formula, which means they grow. Make sense? Here's another scenario for you, and that is the chamber. Now, chambers differ in every community, so you'll really have to get to know and understand what your chamber is like. But the reality is, is the reason that businesses join the chamber is because they believe that's a great networking resource for them. And chambers want to be known as a great place to join because if you join the chamber, your business increases. So the naturally existing economic relationship is the chamber wants more businesses to join because they have more power, more clout. But the people who join have to feel like there's a benefit in joining the chamber. So you see, if they invite you to speak at one of their regularly scheduled meetings, which chambers have almost every month, and you're able to do the performance formula and show their chamber members how to improve their performance personally and professionally through the performance formula, then logic says that those customers of the chamber, those businesses in the community, are gonna go back and their businesses are gonna grow. And so the chamber is gonna say, you can come in and speak to my people, what are you gonna say? You get to explain the performance formula to them. And then while you're giving this presentation to the businesses of the community, that's where you get to tell your story, who you are. And I'm gonna show that in detail when I go over the performance formula, but you're gonna to explain to everybody in the room who you are. And I'm just gonna show you the beginning and the end of that, a simple, simple scenario. So you're up in front of the group, whether this is the hotel group or this is the chamber. And you come out, you're introduced by the host, whether it's the chamber president or it's the hotel manager, and you just come out and you say something simple like this. Hi, I'm Tom Ziegler. My goal in life is to help people and organizations improve their performance. I'm a Ziegler Legacy Certified Trainer. It's my delight to be here. I'm so honored that the chamber has, has blessed this, that they've invited me in. My goal here today is to help everybody in this room learn a simple performance formula that you can use today to improve your business, to improve your personal life, so that you can get more performance, so that with the same group of people, without increasing your overhead, you can raise your performance. And then you launch into your presentation, the performance formula. And then at the end, you close it this way, very simply. It's been my honor to be here. I thank the Chamber for inviting me. And because you guys are members of the chamber, the chamber is allowing me to do something. This is pretty cool. I have a workshop scheduled on goal setting, which we covered in the performance formula. I have a workshop scheduled on goal setting in three months. And what I'd like to do now is to give away a free seat to that, to anybody who would like, you know, so raise your hand if you wanna win. 
So of course the, the audience, everybody wants to win a free seminar. And so that gives you permission to share the seminar, you do the drawing, you get a winner. And then you're able to say the next thing. Hey, because you're members of the chamber and because I'm here today and because this host has been so gracious and I know you guys love Ziegler and you want to go to the next level, I have a special offer. Normally this program is $197, but for those of you in the room, if you know you want to come and you can make a decision today, you can come in and your investment to come is only $139 a person. And if you register today, I have a few Born to Win books. Everybody who registers today gets one of these books. Thank you for your time. I'll be right over here taking it, you know, meeting you, uh, talking about this program. I hope to see you there. That's how it works. So there are so many ways that you can use this naturally eco economic, naturally existing economic uh, referral system, relationships. So what are some other opportunities? Well, there's CPAs and attorneys. Think about this. CPAs support businesses. When those businesses do more business, they grow, that means they have to pay the CPA more money to handle the books. Attorneys. When attorneys get a great reputation, that's awesome. But what's even more awesome is with their client base they're already working with, if their clients grow their businesses, then they're going to need more service from that attorney. So if the attorney introduces you to their client base through this client appreciation, this customer appreciation approach, that means that you win because you're being endorsed by somebody they're already doing business with. You help those businesses grow, which helps the attorney's bottom line. You see where I'm going with this? Naturally existing economic relationships. There really is no end to this. You can think about your vendors. You can think about associations and business owners and executives who you can go out and meet their customers as well. So when you think about naturally existing economic relationships, I want you to start developing a list of people in your business area that have a lot of customers who would benefit from ZLC training. If you do that and you start presenting this format the way we've described, then you're going to have people opening doors to new business opportunities for you. Why? Because your first and primary focus is to make the host look good and to help the businesses in the room grow. When you do those two things, then you're going to be invited back.